Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Total War Warhammer 2 Mortal Empires Co-op. I am the Alchemical Rabbit. And I am Atoli. All right, that was a little dumb. That took way longer after we stopped recording than it should have, but eventually the vampire fell over dead. He did. He face-planted quite dramatically. We had to wait until sunrise. Sunrise came. Oh, he dusted. Of course, of course. Yep, so that was a great attack on his part. Yeah, he did a very good job. We're going to take a 200 gold off of Wait, where's he going? I killed him. He got another lord took his place. There were no men left. Well, I don't know. Like I'm so confused by that. The game was took pity upon him. All right, we are now having a problem. Vampire. I need to kill some vampires. Well, I mean, you just You're did. Foul. I have to kill more of them. You also have these. Uh, oh, have, th th that's right. These are your green skin. Unexpected. They have declared <gasps> war. I shall enter. The See, honestly, this this is not when they want to be going to war with me. I have finished my crusade in the south. It's true. Oh. What? You want me to join the war against the Scourge of Cain? I mean, I think I'm already at war. Well, if they're you? asking you, you're not. Oh, I'm not. Okay. Yeah. Um. I think you'll be okay. Sure. They're giving me 300 gold for it, so sure. <laughs> yeah, the Phoenix Gate is your biggest concern with yeah. that. Yeah, that's but that you have two armies positioned to kind of help with that. I do. So, I think also that means I might be able to get the the sword of Cain. Oh God, that is a risk. Do not consider what you're doing if you take that. What if I put it on my friend, my incompetent friend? What's his name? Gil. <laughs> I mean, the problem Gil is, is like he gets real. Exp I think he causes some problems. He's already he causing it. problems. <laughs> I don't think you understand. Oh, look, a cloaked stranger from a mist-shrouded land of Albion approaches with a request. <gasps> he is of sinister aspect, but assures you that his intentions are good. Oh. oh my, my god, friend, come in, give me that money. Oh. Oh, I have chaos corruption, that's weird. Um, all right, I did clear one grudge. Excellent. So that's good, so that will help with a few things. Speaking of, do we have anything in the Oath Gold sector that we'd like to look at? I don't know, dude. Getting closer. Getting closer. Yeah, we can get a gatekeeper's hammer soon. Ooh, that's exciting. No, um, dwarves have weapon crafting. Oh, that's really cool. I just need more Oath Gold for it. Gotcha. Okay. There's no orcs over here, huh? Surprised there's not at least an army floating around. All right, so he will head back north and probably head for this war. It's going to take the king a while, though. That makes sense. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Yeah, I mean... What? It is... What? Who wants to be summoned, if I dare? I'm, wait, what are you saying? I just suddenly heard, I feel like a dwarf say, Summon me if you dare. Oh, that was just me clicking around. Oh, okay. Apologies. It's all right. I did not mean to cause such issue. Oh no, you're 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 fine. Am I fine? Oh, was it Thorn Ironhammer who said it? It potentially was. Oh. All right, so we're looking good there. Over here, we are upgrading even more for that. No, more money. We want more money everywhere except for here, where we want more growth. Actually, we may not want more growth right now. I need to recruit an army. Are you suffering from like madness? Yes. The gold greed or something? What was it called? Oh, yes, a tiny amount. Okay. Uh, by the way, here are the rebels. Auto resolve it, please. All right, excellent. I shall auto resolve. Excellent work. Yes. They they did. Why right. did they even rebel? Why did they even rebel? It was so pointless. Why even dream? No, no, people, you should dream. No. Dream. All dream right. big. Rebel against the man. All right, we are falling back into Zufbar. Whoever that may be to you. All right. Now that we have taken Zufbar yeah. back, we can now actually pay attention to this territory. Yes. Which is good. All right, we are in this territory, which means we can... Ooh. Okay, that may be a little bit of ex an extreme choice, but ooh. What is it? Here's the thing. I'm about to fight undead. I don't need these here. What are these? Um, I am looking at my recruitment options on global right now because I am I'm sitting on a good chunk of money. 
Oh, gotcha. And so I am immediately throwing it um, into the army in the north. Because okay. what I'm going to do is, so starting next turn or in a turn or two, mm -hmm. I'm going to get a fourth lord up in my home territory. To help with the war against Well, he's the... going to recruit. Okay. And what he's going to do is he's going to get some advanced stuff. So when the king gets there, they'll trade. Makes sense. And then those two armies can go work on things together. Gotcha. Meanwhile, down south, I have Throny, who will continue to keep the peace against the Greenskins. Mm -hmm. And once I feel that things have stabilized a fair amount. Yes. Um, can I have some money? Yeah, sure. Like, I need, like, 400 money. Yeah, that's fine. I can give you more than 400 money. All right. Let's you see. You with your 16 now settlements. Indeed. All right. Can I have... You know what? Can I have 670 gold? You may have 670 gold. So, thank you. Do you do you find yourself out of money when you go to do your heroes? Yes. Yeah, I, I find that happens. Uh, It depends, like... When I'm playing the vampires, like the pirate vampires, yes. uh, no, I do my heroes first because my heroes are a lot more important to me in that game, like playing as them. Mm -hmm. um, but right now as the elves, and this may be a mistake on my part, it probably is, uh, I have not been prioritizing what they do. I also only have the one. Um, and I just don't No, no always, I mean like I do, I'll end up running out of money because I'm just not like prioritizing them. Yeah, I'm like, I'm using this one guy to do, like, assaults, and I keep forgetting. Right. All right. All right, this time we're seizing, and we're just going to continue to siege. Excellent work. <laughs> With both of them up there, it's all good. And then we're going to put... Uh, where's that money building? I had to Do turn. I, I've decided to turn back on taxation in Rib Peaks. Oh yeah, why is that? Well, it so public order was terrible there for a while. Gotcha. Okay. So I had it turned off. Uh huh. It's now at negative three if I turned it if I turn it on, but uh -huh. the place is worth fourteen hundred gold a turn. Oh yeah, then you probably yeah. Yeah, the problem is right now there just isn't any. Um, I need to put a mead, a public order building in. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Because I, I sack, I decided to put a garrison in mm -hmm. in Grom Peak instead. Okay. Should I demolish that? Maybe. Uh, is it? Is it? Are you using it? Not really. It was mostly just a hold in case the undead pushed. Okay. Then, if you don't feel like the undead are likely to push right now, then I would say maybe yes. Mostly not because I'm building a twenty stack on their border. Right. And I think I'm going to push in and, like, ca taking Castle Drakenhof is out of the question, but Eshin isn't. Okay. All right. Let's yeah, see. for Drakenhof, I'll need two armies. Okay. That makes sense. But we should have better war machines by then as well, so I'm not too worried. Yes. Um, I'm just checking diplomacy real quick. Not a problem. Who are you? Oh, Marienburg. I... Oh, Marienburg. Oh, I could try to I could try to have peace with Hexodal. If you want to. I mean, I'm not really bothering them right now. If he'll trade with me, sure. Yeah, because if you're going to turn your He's... attention to the Dark Elves, it yeah. seems like a good idea. Um, Is he willing? He's willing to possibly do a non-aggression. It's moderate. Okay. I'll try it. He rejected my offer. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. Um. All right. New World Colonies. We have a treaty. Please trade with me. No. You don't want to still. Man, you suck here. If I give you a little bit of money, can I give you 300 gold? Like me. Like me more. Why don't you like me? <laughs> maybe maybe they think you're coming off desperate. No, they just... I mean, they actually... I've done a lot of things to like make them like me. They just started, I think, with low neutrality to me. Because hmm. I'm a great power. Yeah. And they're not friends with Hexodal in this. They're actually at war with him. I, I don't know what to tell you. Which is probably why Hexodal... Like, I didn't realize that when I was looking at Hexodal. All right. Anyways, passing the turn back to you. Excellent. All right. I am up to now 5,300 gold per turn. I have begun to accelerate. Good. Yeah, I'm jumping up myself as well. I got 38, 12. I st there's and a couple. And as you of build your trade out, it yeah. will. It will. Well, do also, that. I still haven't. Um, I'm not quite to the point because I took some damage from a couple of sacks. Yeah. Uh, 
mostly because of Noctilus. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, some of your um, secondary buildings. Yeah, got... some of my secondary buildings that were producing money got destroyed, and I had to rebuild them. Mm-hmm. If I could make allies, if I could get you guys confederated... That... I might go ahead and try to confederate um, the... Those elves on Those the coast. Elves, yeah, yeah I, that may be a good idea. Well, because it'll finish one of my territories for me. Mm -hmm. It would for me as well. If I, I have two, two candidates, and they both have benefits. Right. Because I have this one over here with these purple drawers, Barak Var. If they w would, they don't want to. Uh -huh. um, I would have trade options with you. Ah, uh, yes, they that would be awesome. Because they actually have a, um, they actually have a port. Yeah. Okay, good. So he's just gonna start heading that way. That's it's true. We're doing like we're doing all this. We're making all this money. We're not even trading with each other yeah, yet. Yeah, you and I get a trade route up and going. I bet that's gonna be thousands each. Yeah. Oh my god. What? This guy just got a lot of upgrades for doing that attack. Nice. Indeed. Um, let's get assassinated. I do up. love when the heroes like gain two levels from one successful thing yeah, because they were like just on the verge of a level. I think that's basically what just happened. All right, so I'm taking down the Grom Peak Gatehouse. Excellent. Uh, meanwhile, over here, do we wait or do we go for it? I think we're not going to burn the money up here for right now. Instead, we are simply going to go with more front line. All right. More archers. That's what I'm feeling right now. Cool. Sounds good. Yes, and he can pick up the hero on the way. Because Castle Drakenhof is just, I don't think, possible right now. The the garrison in that castle will be insane. Right. However, I think I can go punch a bunch of their other cities around. That'd be cool. Yes. It would be, quote, cool. Oh, wow. I didn't know that was here. What? Um, At the White Tower of Hoeth. I mean, this makes sense, but they have the Library of Hoeth. Yes. Which then gets you, like, a sword master of Hoeth and a library of... or A, a library of Hoeth gets you a library of Hoeth? No, a lore master of Hoeth and then, like, a mage and then a lots of other people. There's lots of things. It gets you lots of things. And then it gets you to the White Tower of Hoeth, mm. which, holy moly, unlocks uh, a lot of hero recruitment. Um, research rate plus 12, hero capacity for lore master of Hoeth plus 2, hero capacity for mages plus 2, hero recruit rank plus 7, hero recruit rank for mages plus 5. Sounds very So fancy. much stuff. So much stuff. It sounds exceptionally fancy. It is, because it's, it's high LV. Hmm. All right, one thing I'm going to check, I'm just going to check these public order things. Yeah, you still need public order. You are actually in a good place. I actually like that for you. You don't actually need public order. You need... Money. More tax rate. Uh, you do need public order. Okay, that's where we are there. Yeah, because right now... So just to give you an idea, um, I don't know if you'll be able to see this. If I confederate, I will take everything I just circled. Yeah, I, I, I see. Yeah. But the other territory that I could take... I mean, that's a lot of trade resources for you, though. It like, is. That this, could be You good. see where I'm circling now, up north yes, a little I bit? Yes, I see that. That is where I would open up a trade route to you. Yes, because these guys... I think I actually am trading with these guys. Well, they, they could trade with me. <laughs> but I don't know. But yeah, I no, you are right. That would give them. me access to salt, extra lumber, and um, marble. Right. And iron. I already have iron, but more is always good. Yes. Yeah, because I at least have... I have some sort of treaty with them. I don't know. It doesn't tell me if it's a trade one. At least right now while I'm looking at it, but... Well, now you can find out. For it's your turn. Is it my turn? All right, let's check. Um... Okay, good. Oh, yes, oh wow. That wasn't even... I didn't realize I hadn't upgraded yet. Um, you know what? Here. You said they don't like you a whole lot? Who? The purple guys? No, they do. Oh, they do, they but they're do. not ready to confederate. They're they're not weak enough is the problem. I need to get stronger in comparison to them. I see, I see. Okay, I was gonna say because I could do the influence. Could you make the border princes and them fight? The those dwarves? Yes. Sure, I can try that. Thank you. 
Um, we're going to have the... Should I put them in the f my spot? I don't know. Yeah. And then... I just want them to have some issues. Yeah, they do like each other, and it's uh, improving. Let's De work on that. Decrease relationship. Please. By planting some key pieces of evidence, we can make it look as though Brynoth Gern Gernderak of Barak Var has been secretly worshipping a god that Valmir Gosser of the Border Princess finds particularly offensive. They will deny and therefore look guilty. Because we are scheming pointy-eared assholes. Told you! Told you! Um... I Excellent. So I did that. That has. They are now deteriorating. Excellent. <laughs> Quite. Recent events. For involving. the Ever Queen. Oh, is this. All that? right. It's time to now auto resolve. Auto resolve. Save. Oh. Might hurt a little. It may. Ouch. But that's okay. And the lost man, many spearmen lost their lives. But I have the green veil now. You do. And I got the horn of Isha. Avalorn is Ooh, dead. That's cool. You hold both one. I. Well, the core. Yeah, I do. Now Protector just... of both one. I mean, quite literally, yes. Yeah. So now you what? Prepare to take the Phoenix Gate. Uh, I think that is going to yes be what I do. Yeah, because you do that, and you will have secured. Everything via ally or yourself on the inside. Yes. That's like the one way they can get in other than the south. Yes. Now, Tyrion, please take care of these raiders. If there, you can. There are raiders. Oh, oh yeah. That um, lizard man army showed up and started to raid, huh? Yeah. Is he going to deal with it? Yeah. I was declaring war on him. Oh. He think, has a faction. Do you, think, do you think that would be like done as soon as you start? he started burning Do you want stuff? to fight these lizard men? You know what? Let's do it. It's Friday. All right. Because we also have reinforcements <laughs> from we... the garrison. They're not great, but... No, but, you know, more bows is more bows. Yep. Well, they have dragon ogres. Yeah. Ooh, that would be very scary if we had large things. It's true. It's true. Yeah. I Instead, mean... Instead, we have a lot okay. of arrows to shoot One them. Thing to, yeah, I was going to say. So here's the thing. Against their normal warriors, our bows will not do much. Because they're shielded? Yes. Okay. Uh, the big guys, the arrows... It's actually... It's actually going to take a lot of arrows. Okay. Thankfully, you have a lot of arrows. I do. I also have spears, so, like, because they are big, right? Yes. Yeah, so, like... Yeah, they, they are going to be pretty blunted by this entire thing. I also have my one unit of white lions. Did I lose a unit of white lions for him, or did he only start, start with one? He only starts with one. Oh, okay. For some reason, I thought he had two. Maybe you recruited one? They're not that advanced. Hmm. Maybe. God, I'm excited to start getting hammers and uh, long beards. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, because of this battle, mm -hmm. we are actually going to go with a cheeky deployment. A cheeky deployment? Are we deploying in the woods? Kind of. Cool. Instead, what we're doing is we're actually deploying on the flank. Ah, makes you sense. See. And so what we will try and do is, um, actually what we're going to do is we are going to deploy as far up as possible. Mm -hmm. And what's going to happen is we're, we're going to take this ridge. Take this hill okay. very fast. We're actually going to start with them on top of each other. Okay. Because. We want them to move as soon as possible. Exactly. So, and then we will put these two over here. So what I'm going to do is I will go ahead and start and pause. Okay. Pausing. Thank you. So what I am going to do is I am going to deploy them as we need them. Like so. Yes. All right, unpause. All right. And once we are in position or battle is joined, we will... Yeah. All right, Tyrion will act as scout because that's what you do with your lord and king. You scout with him. Indeed. Yeah, because those dragon ogres are a high threat to him. Yeah. I've got the other units coming in to uh That is help. fine. That's okay. They are kind of letting us get into position, and I'm okay with that. Yep. 
I'm gonna see if I can tease them. Okay. With Tyrion? <laughs> yep. You laugh. It's working. You laugh. What do these dragon ogres even look like? They look like God, they're so cool looking. Pa okay, give me a pause. Pausing. Thank you. All right. All right, white lions. No. Unfortunately, the white lions aren't great against a lot of things. Right. Um, so those have their targets. Where are you? You are going to go here and here. You two are going to go there. Uh, you. 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 Okay, I have made orders. I'm giving you the archers. Okay. I know that was great YouTube commentary. I am sorry. No, no, you're good. All right. Ready? Yes. All right. You guys pull back. Apologies, trying. Ah, there's the Shagoth. The sh oh, yeah, the leader guy. Big boy, yeah. Make sure you have skirmish mode up on those uh, archers on, on horses. Uh, yes. These ones? Yes. Yeah. Alright, Tyrion, where are you? You're doing what you can. Which is appreciated. Yes. Sorry, just trying to do this correctly. No, no, I agree. Because while you have the advantage here, it's not guaranteed. Correct. So I would rather... Okay, good charge, decent charge. I mean, I know they'd be better on the infantry. All right, thankfully, I did get one of the Dragon Ogres separated by this other unit over here, and I've sort of tied them down. Excellent work. Yeah, I see your spears are... Oh, I see what you're doing. Yeah, see, Sorry, I just... I hadn't even realized about that. Yeah. Thank you. Sorry, I got, I got, like, he, I pulled him away, so. Yeah, yeah, that's a good, that's a good pull. And we're about to break this other unit, and Tyrion, along with the Spears, has been dealing with the Shoggoth. Good. Which is the big version. Yes. Nice. Yep, just broke that one. Good. Chariots, run them down a little. Okay, they're running into the woods. I'm not going into there. Yeah, don't. I beast don't. men, beast men, despite being large, get don't suffer a lot of penalties of moving through woods. Okay, good to know. So you don't want to chase them in the woods. Okay, that makes sense. Especially with large. All right, uh, you are not currently engaging. Why? Okay, that's why. Where are you at? You need to engage as well. You need to gauge as well. Uh, where are you guys? Get in. All right, charging through. Yeah, lizard men are strong, but once you break them, yes, they seem like they. Oh. Yeah, I see them coming back. Yeah, I, I do too. It's okay. Those spears will, uh, will take that. Yep. It's okay. Without the show goths, they can't really do a lot. Good. Good. Yep. Those archers. Yeah, we're are potentially going to kill that show goth actually. I'm kind of hoping. And if not, it's not a... Oh, he just uh, shattered. Yeah, Everything he Everything is did. breaking. Yep, yep. Good, 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 good. I was going to say, with the rest of his line going down, I'm not too worried. Okay, um, all targets, please continue to kill things. Yes. Okay, grabbing these three, getting on targets. Yep. Keep hunting. Technically, I think they could still um, escape Exist. this. Yeah. So, the more of them that we kill here, the better. Yep. Also, it's a weird raiding lizard beast man army. They shouldn't be an old one anyway. Yeah, exactly. I'm wondering if he is part of that. I think other he faction. is. I think he, he might be. be. Well, it said like neutral army, so that still makes me think maybe. I don't know. 
Well, but, it has the red, black, and white, which just does seem like Marauder colors. It does. So I think it was just Marauder colors. Yeah. All right. We are going to see if we can get those Saurus warriors. Nice. Before they hit the edge. I think we're going to do it. Nice. Oh, and we're going downhill. Oh, they're very tired. We're also exhausted. Oh, no, we're only winded. Oh, boy. Oh, 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 stab, 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 much stabbing. The stabbing has continued. Oh, oh, mm -mm. no. Oh, you're kind of directing them away from the And Oh, oh, a couple edge. of them stood up. A couple of them stood up. Let's see how the plan works. Nope. Nope, that one didn't get away. There's like three There's like of them three left. Dudes. There's three dudes left. All right. Oh, nope. There's one guy left. Two left. The other guys. Nope. That's. Oh. 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 Nope. There's still three guys. Oh, two guys. Two guys remaining over here. This is some quality YouTube content. This is what you come here for. This is what you see those ads oh. for, folks. Oh. It's what you pile those dimes upon dimes into our coffers. Indeed. All right. You can end this battle when you want. All right. Cool. I'm ending it. <laughs> I think you might have killed that guy. If not, there's one of them left. It might be. It might be. A whole I do actually think we killed at least one of the dragon ogres. Completely. I was going to say, I think one dragon ogre and if the, the Shagoth may not have lived either. He's got a sliver, at least on my screen. So I think we'll he might have. We'll see when we get past it. the loading screen. Yeah, good to see. Yeah, good to see. Yeah, it was just the archers, man. The yeah. archers took him down. Yep. That's the thing. Tyrion has probably a bunch of buffs on the archers, right? Yeah, I think so. I that think I... that will also help in killing these like more traditionally tanky armies. Yeah. Oh, I got a war banner for that. Nice. All right. I think it's waiting on you. It. I am aware. Are of you that. still loading? Yes. Okay. There we go. Uh, killed two of them actually. We did not kill the Shagoth, but we killed two Dragon Ogre units. Nice. And the sh well, the Shagoth also is like super hurt though. Yes, it is. And actually, can you catch? I think I might be able to. If you are, you can't now. You will be next turn. Oh, he's dead. Oh, I got him. Yeah, All right, just... let's just auto resolve mm -hmm. this. Oh, you poor boy. What what unit in the Elf Army would the a plus five leadership benefit the most? Super elite center of the field, like the White Lions or something. Okay. Tyrion maybe, got maybe, a banner, and I yeah, just I was don't gonna know say maybe. Um, My leadership aura Helms? size can go to plus one hundred percent. Oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! Hold the line. Will be a passive ability. So much. Oh. So actually. much line holdage. All there, right. Uh, oh, oh God! There's lots of things. Okay. Hold on. I could also. <laughs> Have something that gives me negative one public order, but it gives me a melee attack strength of plus twelve and a weapon strength of plus twenty percent. Yeah, that would hurt. I mean, plus minus one is not too bad, right? It's really not. It just makes him a jerk. Tyrion is a little bit of a jerk in my brain. So he is a little bit. I'm gonna give him that. All right. Oh god, he's gonna be a truck. He is. All Secure right. Secure some influence for me, please. Why the heck did you do that weird loop? There was a bridge. You had him across a river. A you were so much larger than that river. I feel like you could have just stepped across it. But you, you know, know it's all a metaphor. It is. It is. But Atoli. Yes. That's it for this week. <gasps> is it? It is. Is, it that, is that this? It's that time again. My goodness. Ladies and gentlemen, if you have enjoyed, please be sure to like, subscribe, and share. Until next time, I've been Atoli. And I've been the Alchemical Rabbit. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you later.